Hello, my name is Nobe, and in today's video I'm going to be making glass painting for the first time. We are starting off with working on the sketch and doing the line art for it. The character that I will be drawing today is Princess Peach from Super Mario. I saw the sneak peek for the new Princess Peach game coming out in 2024 and I am super excited for it. I never got to play the Super Princess Peach game on the DS so I can't wait to play this game when it comes out. When I printed it out the first time, I realized it would be difficult to tell the lines apart when I go in with a sharpie, so I lowered the opacity in my program and reprinted it. Drawing on the glass was not as difficult as I thought it was going to be. It kind of reminded me of drawing on a tablet to be honest. I have been leaving my stabilization off in my art program as I have noticed I was too dependent on it and my hands have been shaky anytime I ink on the paper. I am working on keeping a steady hand again when I'm doing traditional art. The ink dried pretty fast but I was still worried about smudging so I kept my arm up when possible. I just used a wet tissue and it wiped away easily. I want to get a finer pen in the future so I can draw more details the next time I do glass painting. Line work is done now, so we can move on to painting. I have never used acrylic paints before, so this was a learning curve for me. I was laying the paint too thick at first, and the paint looked streaky the more I went over it, so finding the right amount of paint to pick up was key. It kind of reminded me of painting nails, basically. As I started working on the hair, I started getting the consistency more even, and for the shading, I chose to do simple cell shading.
I wanted to make her blush blend, but it was challenging. My medium of choice when working traditionally is watercolors and color pencils, so I tried to approach it that way. It wasn't perfect, but I think it came out nice. After I finished painting everything, I went over it with the sharpie again. I noticed the sharpie would take off the paint if I pressed too hard, so I tried to be careful lining the areas that had thicker paint. What I did like about the lining over the paint was that now the sharpie had more grip, so my hand wasn't sliding so much anymore. And here is the finished result. I had so much fun making this. The colors came out a little duller than I would have liked, but I think she still came out cute. I will definitely do glass painting again. You can find me and more of my work on all the socials under Nobay the Witch. I have Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, and I am here on YouTube. The original line work will be available for Kofi members to download so that you can color it yourself, whether it be digitally or printing it out and coloring it traditionally. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, bye bye.